The Attorney General Faris al Rawi called an urgent news conference this evening to respond to questions about pictures circulating on social media of two children holding what appeared to be assault rifles. This after statements in the Parliament by MP for Arapuch East, Rudal Munilal, relating to ISIS and terrorist threats and the number of young people in terrorist training. I would say they are children with a striking resemblance to senior government officials. And I would today, I would now ask the Attorney General of this country, I will pass this to him now, and ask the Attorney General if he recognizes the children in this picture. With pictures circulating online, the Attorney General said he was inundated with calls. I want to say very categorically that for someone such as Rudal Munilal, who acted as Prime Minister of Trinidad and Tobago, who moved to become the leader of the opposition as leader of the UNC, to raise the issue of children in a budget debate, I find most reprehensible. While the Attorney General says he has not seen the pictures, he admitted to his family undergoing threat assessment training after he got into office. He said the training was necessary, taking into account the nature of the job. That Rudal Munilal has demonstrated himself to be an absolutely reprehensible human being for purposefully twisting positions and making allegations, some of which perhaps don't apply to me, but insofar as I have been asked the questions, I have been asked questions, I'm only here to say, number one, my family certainly was the beneficiary of receiving international protocols on threat assessments and what situations of danger look like, and two, it was under the direct care and supervision of no less an agency than the special forces and the army itself, and it is entirely in their camp. There's been ongoing tension between the Attorney General and Dr. Munilal since the last budget debate when Dr. Munilal shouted obscenities at Mr. Al-Rawi across the Parliament floor.